Welcome to this video from the Mendocino Superior Court Self-Help Center. We are a free court service for people who don't have a lawyer and need legal help with certain types of cases. In this short video, I'm gonna walk you through how you can access online programs that can help you fill out court forms. These programs ask you questions and use your answers to fill out all the court forms you will need for what you're trying to do. You will not see the forms until the end when you finish answering the questions. These forms are good throughout the California courts. Sometimes there are one or two more forms that are only used in a particular local court, but often you can get those at your court's website or the clerk can give them to you when you file your papers. Let's go through two websites where you can find programs to help you fill out the papers for things like restraining orders, a divorce or a legal separation, name changes, eviction, small claims, and more. First, look at my browser and you would type in in yours or in your search engine, sharpcourts.org. That will take you to the Sharp Project, which is a collaborative of many courts in California. And if you go over here to online resources, complete forms online, you'll see the list of programs that exist. So for example, we have civil harassment restraining orders, both the petition and the response, divorce and legal separation, domestic violence restraining orders, petition and response, elder abuse restraining orders, petition and response, eviction for the landlord, eviction for the tenant, guardianship, which is custody um, of minor children by a non-parent, name changes, parentage to establish who the parents of a child are, request for orders, which is used in family law to ask for more, most kinds of orders, and small claims. Let's try out, for example, domestic violence restraining order. You'll come to a page that gives you a video, an introductory video, and a little bit of a description of what the restraining order is for, and then you can click to go to the program itself. So if you're in one of these counties, you'd wanna click here for this program. If you're in one of these counties, you'd wanna click here. If you're not in any of these counties, you still can go to either program. It'll just mean that some of the local forms that your court might use are not included with the program. But like I said earlier, you can get those from the court itself. So since we're in Mendocino, let's try this link and I'll show you how it works once you get to the Law Help Interactive page. Law Help Interactive is the service that provides these programs. So once you get to the page, you can either just go straight to getting started or you can create an account. The advantage of creating an account is that you can save your work. And also in case there's power outages or your Wi-Fi might go down, you can save your work regularly so that you don't lose it all. Let's just for the sake of going a little bit faster, going, we'll go to get started. And you'll see that once you agree to the terms of service, it'll take you into the interview. It first gives you an explanation of what a domestic violence restraining order is for, what kinds of things you can ask for, and how to use the program. And then you simply navigate from page to page by hitting next. So you'll find a few introductory screens and then overall a sense of what the steps are involved, and then it'll go straight into asking you questions. At the end, you will hit finish, and it will allow you to either save or download your forms and print them out. Let's go now to the other program. In your search engine or your browser, type in Guide and File California, and then you will go to anything that looks like this, Guide and File, Odyssey, File, and Serve, and same idea, you'll click on start your legal process and you'll get a list of the available programs. As you see, there's a lot of overlap. So divorce or legal separation or an annulment, restraining orders, evictions, income and expense declaration, which is very common in family law cases, guardianship, parentage, request for order, small claims, limited conservatorship. So about the same number of programs as the other site, maybe a couple of more programs. Let's go to the domestic violence one to give you an idea of how this one works. So once you come here, you'll also have the choice to save your work and for that you have to create an account or to simply just start. And once you start, the interview will load 
and you'll start seeing some introductory information as well as some questions for you to start answering and just hitting next to go from screen to screen until at the end you have all your forms to put together. We hope that you found this short video helpful. If you're gonna be filing your case in Mendocino County, feel free to email us at selfhelp at mendocino.courts.ca.gov so that we can help you figure out the program and get your paperwork in order. Your county should also have a self-help center and you can find their information and location and hours at their website. Thank you.